Ohayo! My name is Minami Toko and welcome back to Life is Strange Before the Storm. So we need to find the belt, which should be in the bag over there maybe. But let's look around some more. Hey now. Sharing is caring. Stay. <laughs> yep, sharing is caring as always. Computer, can we take a look at this computer? To internet or not to internet. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess in modern society the answer is to internet, of course. I have feelings about this. Most of them are not good feelings. Uh, what does that mean? And where's my ah, uh, there's my mouse. And why is this on here? Why do theater kids take themselves so seriously? Rachel Amber playing Prospera. A newcomer to Blackwell Academy, Rachel Amber blew the doors of her audition with a heartbreaking reading of Blanche from Tennessee Williams, a street car named Desire. Other interests include athletics, debates, team boosters, fundraising, local history and nature. Rachel hopes to one day grace the stages of Broadway and the silver screen of Hollywood. Yo, yeah, who doesn't dream of that? Well, obviously the, the, there's also shy kids who want to do something else, but Hollywood, wow, you gotta work hard for this. Wait, Nathan is in this too? Playing Caliban, a favorite son of the oldest and most influential family in Acadia Bay. Nathan hopes his performance of The Tempest will only further the legacy of the Prescott name at Blackwell Academy. Playing Caliban has been a challenge for the sophomore who enjoys sports, photography, and usual hangouts with his many friends. Okay, are we gonna actually, like, see this play? Because I'm interested in Nathan Prescott's doing. Dana Ward playing Miranda. A sophomore, Dana has performed in two other productions at Blackwell Academy since her freshman year. And choice football? Okay, social media and school dances. Ugh. I don't like to dance. Nope, not at all. She hopes to be a member of the Vortex Club when she's a senior. Oh wait, the Vortex Club? Isn't that this um, like super famous club that only likes uh, like some people can enter? Hayden Jones playing Ferdinand. This show marks the introduction of Hayden Jones to Blackwell Academy's drama club. He auditioned on a dare and, as it turned out, actually really digs acting. A sophomore, his other interests include playing sports, herbals and taking long walks in the woods. Well, those profiles are quite interesting. Juliet Watson and Travis Keaton directing. Oh well. Stage manager, who else and special thanks, Principal Wells, Rose Amber, Carolyn Prescott, <sighs> and especially the Prescott Foundation, yes, of course. What's this? This poster definitely says something. Something, yeah, something. Oh, Papillon. He, butterfly. What the heck? RA will suck as Prospera. If VC had any talent, maybe she would have gotten the part. Talent? Is that what got Mr. K to cast you, slut? Guess they don't call it Drama Lab for nothing. Whoa. I can comment? Come on, Chloe. What to say, what to say. Yeah. Slut shaming? Let's go with this. What are you writing actually? Come on, I want to see Slut it. Slut shaming is so 2009. VC should know. <laughs> yes. We see. Is that Victoria by any chance? Uh, props? You've got nice props here. And a dish, nah, poster, poster, let's just get the belt, let's just get the belt. 
Ui. Are you a goth, Rachel, or not? What is that? Rachel looks so happy here. Yep. Is that her father? Is something going to happen to her father? There's Rachel's belt. Or that something happened already? Yes, so I'll go give this to Rachel now. Yep. Can I actually stand on this? No, I can't. Oh, but I wanted to go on the stage. Nah. Okay, Rachel, you here somewhere? Ah, uh, behind those tempest note. Look at that note. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta turn up the heat. <laughs> Ooh, come on, stop clicking out of the game. Another note. I'm gonna guess it's from Logan. Uh, guess who? Uh, well. Logan, maybe. Look at those costumes. costumes in here. <laughs> Am I the only 100? student who's not in this show? That's not 100. It's not 100, but... Uh, Rachel? Is this your belt? Yes! <laughs> Thank you. Uh, throw the belt over? Just to be cool? Here you go. Ow! <laughs> Why did you say attack me with it? Sh Sorry. Yeah. Oh, Chloe's so nervous. I've never seen her that way. Chloe oh, Price. Wow. Rachel Amber. Last night was amazing. What did you do actually? Getting attacked was amazing. Fire work was pretty cool. I, I'd never seen Firewalk live. Pretty fierce show. We'll have to do it again. To tell the truth, I went to bed last night wishing it never had to end. But then Ooh. I thought, why? Why does it have to end? Are you too flirting? Uh, maybe it doesn't? Maybe it doesn't uh, have to end. Exactly. How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Ooh. Has a Rachel Amber gone rogue? <laughs> oh well, just... Fuck yes. I was born to ditch. Let's get the hell out of here. Like, right now? But I wanted to go to chemistry class. Oh. oh but I like chemistry. Ah, more. Oh wait, isn't that the? You sure you don't want to just grab the bus or? Nope. If we're gonna go rogue, we're doing it right. Mm. Well, what the hell am I getting into here? I don't know. So that's the story of how they started an adventure together. Where does this thing go? I don't know. North? Maybe we'll end up in Seattle. <laughs> Holy cow. Also Can nice wheels press. down there. The view's amazing. Yes, it is indeed. Oh. Rachel wants me to pull up a chair. Maybe one of these crates. Mm, I don't know. But, Elliot, let's talk later, okay? Uh, well, maybe one of those crates. That seems to be the one I need, need to get, but Unity, Aurora Greek, what are those? Guess we're not the first ones to hop on this train. Probably not, no. I wonder no. what the symbols mean. Shipping label. Whoa. Nathan's dad is a Terminator? What? That totally checks out. <laughs> Read? Come on. Our riches are us. Uh, if 
five, 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 five. Prescott Foundation. Okay, then. Okay. Cargo? Let's look at that. I feel pretty confident there's going to be a dead body in here. Maybe. Maybe not. So... Let's move this crate. Things heavier than it looks. <laughs> Maybe there is a dead body in there. Sit down. Oh, let's just talk. Oh no, we There's can only look at her. <sighs> okay, sit down. All right, Chloe, you're on a freaking train with Rachel freaking Amber. Play it cool. Don't get nervous. I is this nervousness? <laughs> is that what this feeling is? Wish Max were here so I could ask. That's why she got so confident in three years, probably. Should I make small talk? Is that what people do? <laughs> yes. Me all day. All day. Oh, should I talk to this person? Oh, what what should I say to her or him? Or mm, I want to go there, but I don't know where to go. So should I just ask this person? Oh shit, that person just went by. Where's the next person I could ask? That that that's my that's my day every day because I'm so damn shy. <laughs> um, say nothing. Uh, nice weather. It's nice weather we're having. Weather is always a good start, what? I think. The, the weather? <laughs> it's nice. <laughs> it sure is. Oh, good gosh. That's so me. <laughs> so, it's kind of weird that we're hanging out. You mean because I don't hang out with anyone and I don't have any friends? You have friends. Well, I used to. Friend. Singular. Her name is Max, but she left for greener, more northern pastures. Mm. That sucks. <sighs> Talk about Mr. Keaton. I didn't mention it earlier, but you seem to have some kind of Jedi mind powers over Mr. Keaton. And <laughs> Jedi you mind we power. We were talking about true love in the play. <laughs> I guess you could say I'm good with people. Yeah. Just don't pull that stuff with me. <laughs> you will get on this train. Oh, shit. <laughs> I bet you're wondering what we're doing. Yep. The thought occurred, yeah. Well... I wanted some company. That's it? What? Why? It. How? Huh? Uh, uh, duh? What the heck, Rachel Amber? Uh, I need more than that? Try again. I'm going to need more to go on than that. Joy rides with me aren't fun? Joy rides to where again? Life needs a little mystery, Chloe. Let's do something fun. Uh, agree or flirt? Uh, just agree? Okay. I'm listening. Two truths. And a lie. What? Oh. I think we should play Two Truths and a Lie. It's a game where each person offers up three facts about themselves, two of which are the truth, and one of which is a lie. Right. And then the other person has to guess which is which. Ooh. Uh, well, good to get to know each other, I guess. Agree? Sounds fun. You're on. Okay. So, who's gonna I'll start? start? First, I'm ambidextrous. Second, I was born in New York, the land of fashion and Broadway, to which I will one day return when my heinous exile here in Arcadia Bay comes to an end. New mm. York, huh? I've never been. Not a world traveler? Not yet, at least. If you could travel anywhere, where would you go? Russia, Greece, Kathmandu? I don't know. Kathmandu? Just One because day, it sounds? I'm going to climb Everest. Interesting. 
And I thought moving away from Arcadia Bay was ambitious. <laughs> What's your third thing? My third thing? Yep, you have Two truths and a lie. You say three things. Right. I'm a Leo. Meow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, ambidextrous, born in New York, and a Leo. Gotcha. So, which is the lie? Oof. Which one? Well, she's good with people. Oh, good gosh. New York, maybe, because she wants to go to Hollywood? Because she also said something about fashion stuff. Well, she is fashionable. Holy cow, she looks cool. Mm. What the heck? But... Wait. Maybe she just wanted to confuse us with the third thing because she's... Oh, hmm, I have to say a third thing. Hmm. So, maybe Leo? Uh, nah. You wouldn't come up with such a thing in like two seconds. Let's go with New York. You seem more like a Cali girl to me. Damn, oh. Price, not bad. Yes. Long Beach, in fact. West Coast is the best coast. I've only ever lived in Oregon, so nothing to compare it to, I guess. Then we'll have to change that one day, won't we? Oh. Okay, your turn, Price. First fact. Right. Something about myself. Yep, something about yourself. Should I start yourself. things off with a lie or with the truth? Or should I cheat? Ooh. Let's see how good she really is at this game. Yep. So... Let's put a lie at the front. I broke my hand punching someone. I'm allergic to cats. I'm in a band. <laughs> I'm allergic to cats. <laughs> well, then you wouldn't be sitting here right next to a Leo. Meow. Um, I broke my hand punching someone. I once broke my hand punching Stephanie Kowalski in fifth grade. No way. Bitch took my yoohoo. Knocked her the fuck out. I see you like to write notes to yourself. Helps me stay focused. Also, sweet scar. What scar? Uh, then let's go with the truth. Uh, country music makes me throw up. Really? I thought she loved that country song because her dad liked it. Oh, or maybe that's why she doesn't like country music. Uh, I love science. I wanted to be a pirate as a kid. I love science. I love science. Seriously, I think Neil deGrasse Tyson is the shit. Huh. And should I cheat now or not? Nah, let's go with another truth. Uh, I wanted to be a pirate as a kid. I used to want to be a pirate when I grow up. But I that's... I kind of still do. Arr. That, that's an obvious thing, right? So, Rachel... You're hella mysterious, Chloe Price. Uh, Isn't she? Hella? <laughs> Who says that? It's a Cali <laughs> thing. Anyway, I think I have your number. Of course you wanted to be a pirate. Sail the open seas. Buckle swash. Plunder secret treasure. Yep. So, pirate. Obviously true. Be my first mate? No, Maybe that would be, like be Max. My first mate. Oh, are you accepting applications? Considering it. But that w w would have been Max. Okay. Not you say you love science, but you are failing chemistry. You're saying failing chemistry means I hate science? Or that Blackwell doesn't inspire your best work? Hmm. Uh, well, let's go with something that Chloe would say. That place is a hellhole filled with shit, where shitty people go to be shitty to each other and themselves. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel, though. Anyway, 
School sucks, but you love science. I'm gonna say true. Oh. Now, about this broken hand story. Rachel's not good. That I don't think you could knock Stephanie Kowalski out. A bitch takes your yoo-hoo, she's gotta get got. Tam straight. But you didn't get that scar from punching someone. No. Huh? That scar is from a distal radius fracture. How? How could you possibly know that? I broke my wrist when I was 10. Ah. Uh, the point is, I know that the scar you've got comes with breaking your wrist when you fall. Like, from a skateboard? Yeah. <laughs> I okay. Guess six years ago? You were Seven. good oh, at this. Shit. I always thought I was a good liar. Good thing you're pretty. <laughs> so, if my math is correct, you told me two truths and one lie. Yep. What? You expected me to cheat? Winners make their own rules, Chloe. You are crazy good at this game. Yep. A lifetime of studying the human condition. I'm well, impressed. I'm impressed. Really impressed. I bet it's hard to impress Chloe Price. I'm gonna feel good about that one. <laughs> I don't know, it's so cheesy, but district it's... Attorney, I guess lying is something you're used to. Seriously? Seriously. I know who to call if I need to get out of a ticket then. <laughs> Not that I have a right of my own. Car first. Embarrassing number of moving violations second. Yep. Hey, thanks for trusting me. Trusting you? You played the game. And not everyone would admit to wanting to be a pirate. Why not? But eye patches are so cool. And rum is delicious. You had I some? Guess. You opened up a lot. That's all. Uh, it's not a big deal. Thanks. I hate to break it to you, but. Chloe Price is not exactly renowned throughout Arcadia Bay as a bastion of trust and empathy. <sighs> trust is hard. Trust doesn't exactly come easy to me. Maybe if you'd had my life, you'd understand. No, I get that. On the other hand, I got on this train with you, didn't I? Fair <laughs> point. Yep, fair point, right? Are those two flirting, actually? Wouldn't mind listening to some music. Do you have some with you? Uh, share with her, let's share with her. Let's be hey. nice. Wanna listen? Let's be nice for a change. Such nice music. I, I just love the style of this game regarding art and also regarding music. I just love this thing. Also the first part and it has an awesome story. But yeah. Let's continue on with that awesome story. So, what next? Full bracelet. I've had what? it, I guess, since I was a kid in Long Beach. It reminds me that there's more to experience out there than just Arcadia Bay. Maybe one day I'll go back to Long Beach. Or anywhere but here. Maybe sooner than later. Oh gosh, knowing what's gonna happen to Rachel. Oh, yeah, I think you're right sooner than later. Me too. Arcadia Bay can suck a bag of dicks. Sometimes I feel like I've got no reason to stay. Don't be surprised, Chloe, if one day I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Check it out! We're here! Where? Where is here? What? Where is here? Jump and find out. Did oh. you say jump? Jump! Oh well, jump then. 
<laughs> Good gosh. Yeah, jump and find out and yeah, just jump, I guess. F it, yeah. So where exactly are we? And why? Why would someone like Rachel Amber skip classes like this? No oh, school sucks. Let, let's just go out, of, get out of here, and go somewhere. So where exactly is here? Reminds me of the lighthouse. But it isn't the lighthouse. Northwest Weller? This isn't the lighthouse, obviously. But where is it then? Hey, it's actually a pretty nice view. Glad you approve. Yeah. And as your reward for making it up here, I have a new game for us to play. Another game? Another one. I like games. Deal with it. This is Seems like it. theater class. It's all about improvisation. Ooh. That's a challenge. Yep. And we're going to take that challenge in the next episode. So thanks everybody so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Until then, stay true to yourselves. Us.